Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Uh, today I'm back with more Undertale Yellow. I was gonna record this a bit earlier, but I was having some troubles with the game audio not recording, my audio bugging. I actually, I was, the furthest I got was one room ahead, so I'm not gonna worry about that too much. Sir Slither has a proposition real. No, I don't. believe yes we're gonna go far you and me oh oh they come from oh they come from all directions i was thinking it was just top you know oops Shut up, Lowey. <sighs> oh, what? Please. No, if I healed, I might actually be able to, you know, fight it. I used to be so good at this game. See, I don't know how to dodge. But... I don't know why I didn't dodge that. Mm. Why did I go down? No, I fucked up. I'm just gonna play. Oh, I see. This looks like progression, and I actually kind of want to explore a bit, so I'll go up. Oh, this guy again. I forgot all my glasses for this guy. Bam! Guess who it is? That's right, it's Mo. Long time no see. How the bit? Don't answer that, we don't have the time. I'm here to make you a brand new, uh, hot climate culture, a hot item. Check it. That's right. I went all out this time. It's a real delicacy around here. It's called water. Catchy name, I know. Luckily for you, I'm giving out free samples. Want a glass? Coming right up. One moment. If you know your boy Bo, you know I have uh, planned all of that. Here's my real product, Ice Tea. It's like the sequel to water. Way better. Now I'm very real with you. The tea doesn't have ice in it particularly. It started as glass of ice, but that melted, and all I had to do was throw a tea bag in there and wham. Don't worry, it tastes better this way. Here's what I got. I get some nice tea. Didn't think I would, I thought I'd make it past. Oh, 
wonder how far I am in the game. Now, my friend told me about this scarf that heals a lot of health. I might go check that out. Right, if I can, I can figure out how to get back to Sweden. I'll, work, I'll focus on progressing for now, but if I get to a part that I can't pass, I'll go try and get that scarf. Told me something about I need to get the hot coffee to someone, and they'll give me a map that I need to go give to those people who need a map. And they'll give me something which I bring back to the guy I gave my coffee to. Then he'll give me back a warm coffee which I can give to the guy with the tongue stuck, and then I'll get. The thing I need. Yeah, I got a... something. Flint. Oh, I just need a crafting table. I can make some flint and steel. I'm sure I can find some way to get to the nether. Oh, wait, that's actually what we're doing, okay. I was joking. And we are making flint and steel. I'm pretty sure that I should be focused more on going to the nether than doing this, but who knows, maybe we'll take it. Okay. Progression. A bowl of shit Okay. I see. It's like they bring out the red cape and near the top. Oh, it's getting higher. Okay. 
Yeah, I see I avoid that one. Okay, and then I'm supposed to do that. I'm just gonna do this. Okay, now to be clean. I don't know why you're still trying to attack me. Okay, now I'm gonna go heal because... I am about to die. And I don't really want to use my healing items. This guy looks sad. Does he want this? No. He does want it. Okay, so this is like undying. Arrows. Undying arrows, but a lot more annoying to dodge on the main map. I wonder what happened if I said I was going to do some of these videos and that. And they're not. I don't care if I am children or really well. Uh, I hope this is like a Donkey Kong Country section. We're gonna have to like jump with it. Uh, she's just gonna be like my what section two. <sighs> oh, sorry. Sorry if I sound a bit more tired than you uh, than I usually do. Just I just am. 
I know it's just stating the obvious, but um. Get too much sleep. Okay, I want to leave here. So that's not right. Uh, Go right now. Let me see the yellow one. Fruitcake. I wonder if this desert area is going to be longer, longer or shorter than this one. Probably longer. No, it's not. All 
right. Oh, I thought it was a cutscene. I'm guessing this is like the undying of the game. Halt! I, Obeil Dora, have cast myself with confrontation. The air is much too quiet, much too dreary. You must make no noise when you move. You act with a feeling of flavor. If I did not know any better, I may have mistaken you for a um, uh, sent sentinel of silence. No, no, this will not do. You must prove to me that you have what it takes. I would stake to live a life of richness. I challenge you to dance. Truly, when finding himself, he must ignite a passion within. Let us do it. I want to see your spirit on fire. One, two, and. Right in that phone can? I they did bad. I I suck at rhythm games. How long is this fight? I don't think it matters what I actually do. This is really cool. But yeah, I'm pretty sure this is just the other end of the game. I like this.
This is not good. Give me the heal. Please let this end. I press Z, I press Z, I press Z. <laughs> oh my god. This battle's gonna suck because I hate rhythm games. It's fun. But I'm also terrible at it. An Undertale game that knows my one weakness. I really hope this isn't the end of the game, so I don't want to have to do this more than once. I don't want to have to be chased by this guy and have to do this several times. I can't wait until genocide when I get to kill this guy. So why did I take damage? I need, I need to heal or I'm gonna die. Oh, please kill me. Actually, no, please don't, because I don't want to play, have to restart this battle. Rubber. Uh oh. What did I die to? There was no notes yet. No. What? How did I die? I just I just exploded. Why? Oh shit, I tapped up here. Wait, hold on. Um, I'm not gonna do this fine, because... Uh, I just wanna see something. Oh, well, that makes a lot of sense. If you press Z at the wrong time. Okay, that's a cool one. If you press Z at the wrong time, it also hurts you. That's probably what I did. I didn't press the last one. I 
I think this next attack is the last one, because whenever I get to this one, he talks about the finale. I know I did it again. Wait, this is the finale probably then. Please be it. Please let that be it. Why? That was like a 3 no, 3 no, 3 no. I hate rhythm games. Oh. <sighs> Please let that be it. I don't want to play a rhythm game any longer. <laughs> Thank God. Huff, huff, you've proven your passion, little bum. I apologize if the dance was uh, sternness on your health. 
sometimes uh, having fun means a few doctor's visits. However, it seems that you are you do you do not love dance as much as I. Perhaps you might have missed other means. I've considered uh, that for a mon quite quiet monsters such as you. Um, ah, well, at least I hope my bright your day has been brightened. I wish you a fulfilling journey. Farewell. Thank God I never have to see that guy again until the genocide. I really hope that the genocide battle is harder. If it is, I'm like, I don't know. It's going to take so long. It's going to be like harder than sand. It's harder. That sucked. Save, please. Okay, play ground. Oh wait, there we go. Clover, you're alive, you're here, you're here. I can't believe myself. I left you alone in that cave. You had to be brave to do you had to brave the doom for yourself. I'm a horrible friend. They trust me to be a royal guard and I left a child for dead. Like, what's wrong with me? I yes. Thank you. You're clearly able to take care of yourself. That crash just happened so fast. When I saw what had happened to you, I panicked. I flew over the sand to landscape to find this town. I soon realized that I couldn't risk getting other monsters involved. They might have questioned me, and but I cannot keep secrets. They could have turned into more sinister royal guards. Uh, so I, uh, I sat back at for an hour thinking what a piece of garbage I am. Uh, then I got the courage to travel back to you and apologize, but uh, here you are. So, uh, I'm deeply sorry. Thank you, Clover. Uh, you're very kind. Anyway, we should move on. I decided I won't leave your side now. I'll follow wherever you lead. I've just endured some crazy underground shenanigans, though. I'll understand if you need to rest for a bit. If you want to hang out around, that's great. Uh, I didn't get to sightsee all of, all of, at all over, way over there. Um, well then, friend, shall we be off? Can't put on swing anymore, Sag. I didn't need to do that. Whatever. Oh yeah, so this is where the rocks were blocking earlier. Okay. So is this gonna be like Deltarune battles where Martlet joins me, or? Or is Martlet just gonna stand and watch me get beat? Hmm. 
I need to find a key somewhere. I don't remember those guys. I bet I'll come back later and there's gonna be a tree. Oh, oh hey Clover. Remember how I told you I had friends to be human last week? That's her. You still think that I'm your captain. Your captain did not explain to you that I'm not human, right? Please tell me she did. Oh, I'm so sorry. I just thought you... No, no, I'm sorry. I just get it off and... It's totally fine. You won't believe how many grumpy monsters I deal with. Not that you're a grumpy monster. I'm sure that you're very nice. <laughs> anyway, uh, what's your name? So, uh, uh, hi, no, not you, silly. Her. Hi, uh, actually, how about... Uh, oh, that's cool. Because that's the uh, Undertale Red, so like a really early thing game, right? Uh, actually, how about Red? That's what your uh, colleagues keep calling me every time I get falsely apprehended. To be honest, I hope that eventually I'd be caught enough times that you would be recognize me and it would stop. It might just be wise to join the guard at this point. Oh, yeah, and then um, they do join the guard. Becomes the Undertale Red Fed game or whatever it is. Join? That would be fantastic. I'd be glad to show you the ropes of my job. You could even help me build puzzles. That might be a code violation now that I think about it. <laughs> it's fine. What? It can't be that easy to get in, right? I mean, they let me join. We'll figure it out. <coughs> For over an important business judgment, but I should be free next week. You can find me doing my duty around Snowden any day. Oh, you serious? Ah. <laughs> I mean, uh, uh, haha, sure. This sounds like a plan. See you then. See ya. Okay, that's, uh, that, I think that's cool. Oh, I have... This reminds me of a very bad place. Oh, so the key's probably a secret then. Well, oh, uh, I left all IG at home. Would you let me on? Thank you. Uh, I wish that Clover will make it back home safely. Now uh, you have me and a wish on your side. I thought that train track was what I was on. Hang on, I think someone's coming this way. Is this like the. No, this is Undyne, this is a fish lady. Guys, look at here, someone, is new, someone new has stumbled into our humble town. This better not be another joke. 
for once don't look like it is. Hey, uh, strangers. Oh, hello. Uh, we're just passing through. We mean no harm, I promise. That's what the last guy said. Let's just get, uh, let's just say he's the one with the wind now. Oh my gosh, you. <laughs> I'm just kidding around. You were shaking your boots for a second. <laughs> you guys sure got me. That wasn't very funny, Edward. I can assure you, we're the light to be around. Nothing but, uh, nothing you can't handle, I'm sure. I, uh, well, why do you two insist on scaring away every monster you meet? At least Mooch never steps outside of her bounds. Never. Uh, well, it's a pleasure to meet you for, but we'll be going now. Hold it right there, Missy. Now, this is undying. Are you give him, uh, come on. That ain't the way to treat guests now, is it? My name's Northstar. I run this town. Not alone, of course. These fine monsters are my posse. Together, we are... The Feisty Five. Our name stands for... Fearlessness. Excellence. Intuition. Sneakiness. Toughness. Youthfulness. Justice. The J is silent. Anyway, now that we're do now that we're introduced, I'd lay I'd be glad to give you and your buddy a tour. Hold on. Your buddy. Are they a human? Um well, I won't say no. I knew it. There ain't no dumb on my this kid is a real living authentic human. Sorry about this. I gotta seize this once in a lifetime opportunity. Ed, fetch me that kid. Sure thing. <laughs> Squeaky sound. Wait, what are you doing with Clover? Ah, Clover. Isn't that, isn't, that's a mighty fine name. Answer your question, Feathers. Clover and I got a town to run. But don't feathers me. You're speaking to Martlet of the Royal Guard. Now I will, I can, and will report you to King Asgore. You're a Royal Guard. That's funny, because I don't see anything to indicate that. Now, armor, weapon, badge, I I left it all on my post and so did Please don't bother trying to fool us. He's right. I'm truly sorry about this. I really am. But business is business. Together, we'll be the Feisty Six. The alliteration. Shh. Clover, I, I can't go up against these guys. Don't worry, I'll figure this out. Star, should we be doing this? Poor Martlet is upset. Uh, don't be a buzzkill, Murray. When's the last time something exciting happened around here? You've got a point. <clears throat> this town's full of excitement. Especially now. Let's go, bud. Oh, and Feathers, welcome to the Wild East. Barkeep, we grow, uh, grow. I have an announcement to make. This little fella right here is Clover. Hey, Star. What the hell are you doing bringing a human in here? Uh, uh, servo, servo, uh, shush. Now, I know what you're all thinking. But trust me, Clover ain't no, uh, greenhorn. No, they know what they're doing. Just look at that hat. Actually, uh, I think this could be fun. Donna hit me. Alright, no more help with the crowd. Um, ladies and gentle monsters, as uh, Sir Oba said, Clover is a human. I know, exciting stuff. A real honor. Now, I would let Clover tell you all something about their life. But I've been studying up. I'm a bit of a human expert if you didn't know. Ah, oh, great. Here we go. Here we go indeed. Did y'all know that humans use monster fur for, tr for transportation? Ooh. It's true. Large four-legged monsters. They put seed on top of them and everything. They're called horses, star. 
Ah, so you already know one of them personally. That's quite impressive. Did you also know that humans are fireproof? When they're feeling accomplished, they ride monsters straight into a huge fire sphere. So, the monsters burn, right? Most monsters aren't fireproof. Star, are you saying that my friend horses were killed by the fiery sphere? No, well, I'm not quite sure. I'll ask Clover. Clover, do the monsters die? Good, I regret sharing that fact. Pretend I never said nothing. Anyways, we all know that. Look, Star, if you don't, if you don't need to keep this up, because it's all true, every word. Ah, I knew it. I'm pretty darn good, aren't I? You're the best. Yeah, the only sheriff for me. Ah. Well, I reckon we're done here. Y'all can go back to your daily lives for now. As for you, Clover, uh, it's about time where you see, uh, you see what this town has to offer. I'll give you a personal tour, but if there's one thing you have to, if you, there's one thing you have to come from you. Take your time, exploring. Talk to the townsfolk and enjoy yourself. I'll be waiting here for you. Give me a shout when you're ready to start training. You there, human. You okay? Really? Well, alright then. I apologize for Star's Annex. He's really into human culture and whatnot. You show up here and he flips out. I mean, it's quite unbelievable. Few humans have ever wandered into the underground before, but I never set foot on these sands. All that to say, I'm glad you did. My name's Seropa. Seropa. I'm a friend of Stars, but not part of his posse. They're a bit too rowdy for my taste. Uh, may I ask your name? Welcome to the underground, Clover. Your tire is surprising, I must say, but um, I won't press you on the matter. I'm afraid Star is going to drag you to its activities for a while. You must have places to go, correct? The castle, the barrier, you surely want to go home. I'm being honest, I haven't seen Star this uh, ecstatic at some time. At least you entertain, uh, entertain him a bit. Roll with his punches. I'll see what I can do uh, about allowing you to leave. I know a safe path to Hotline through the. Ah, I'm getting ahead of myself. Talk to you later, Clover. It was nice to meet you. Or Flowey Scalway hat. It looks expensive, makes me think it's part of a task. Hmm. But this is part of the genocide route.
Oh, 45 seconds, right? Yeah, it's like 40. I should have 125 because it's like 45, yeah. I'm not going to be doing any more voice today. It's not today. Alright. <sighs> Next time I get a chance to save, I'm probably just gonna end the video. Cause I'm way too tired to play keep playing this right now. Oh, a duel. After their next next save. Oh my god. Mm. <laughs> what kind of paperwork is that? Sounds like they're watching Looney Tunes. Okay, so I don't actually know what. What?
this 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 game's awesome. Tell me true. Ruined all this. This is nice. I really understood it. It makes monsters like Star happy, it's fine. This whole thing is like a dream to him. It's kinda goofy, but nice to see someone so passionate. Our passion can go so far. You wouldn't believe how much parents talk to me about it. Really kind of folks who own a farm up north. It's actually I mean, we look so if you can believe it. Oh, okay. And the corn, they grow so good. They used to give my husband uh, chujin baskets at full every other week. Anyway, I trailed off. Where was I? Back. Turns out I had one just your size and the exact same color. Like just near something. Yeah. Wow. We couldn't even tell a change for our standings before. Look great. Um what do you think, uh Saroma? It's nice, isn't it? Well, I'd say this is this mission was a great success. Go on and take a break, Rover. I'll be waiting for you. Seeing as the original plans were altered, we got catching up to do. Let's gather the others. Thanks to Ace, uh, Key, and I for a little fashion detour. Uh, great job there, thank you, sir. Clover looks much better now. I agree, Clover's looking like a real Wrangler. For sure. That new gun is awfully shiny. I had to shake Mr. Blackjack down for it. So uh, I was real tough too. Put old Jack in his place, I did. You could have sent me in to get it. You know the best. I'm the best negotiator. We may bend the rules a bit, but we ain't bandits. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Let's get to the mission already. Right there. Where right you are, Ed. What other mission would I be? <laughs> you want me to skip before? Get ready, Clover. It's time for us to do one. What do you mean do one? That's what I said. No, you pronounce it with an ooh instead of an ooh. Boss, have you been skipping cowboy grammar class? Do one, do one, who cares? Tomato, potato. Uh, young lady quit interrupting me so often. Upset my frontiers and. Uh, where was I? Oh, yeah. It's time to uh, participate in a carefully timed shooting competition. Moach provided Clover with this designated tool. It's a BB gun for the duel. Well, I'll uh, take the six shooter off your answer now. Moach, bring the gun here. That's what I was gonna do, Murray. Get off my back, will ya? Alright, it's finally time to go head to head. Wait. What is it, Ace? What could possibly see, be so pressing that injured my life again? I forgot the safety glasses. Gee, boss, get a hurt close. Right. Take a shift. I right, take a shift to the and all that for you, okay? Bring more glasses, yeah. I want to pair with the blue frame. Flames. The red flames clash with my uniform. Here. Now we're in business. Alrighty, Clover. Gonna take ten paces and then turn to face each other. When you hear the draw sound, or grab your gun and shoot as fast as you can. Here we go. Ah, oh, too bad. Let's try one more time. Star, Star, are you okay? Pretty much. The opposite of that. Oh, Star, I'm so sorry. Who, uh, who will you give your inheritance to? Not you. Heck, Clover. This was your emotional trauma test. This job may not, uh... 
uh, swaddler stones and rainbows, you understand? Might end up hurting someone and must carry the weight on your back. Hope that I didn't scare ya. Anyway, it's too fast. I'll be waiting in the saloon when you're ready for the next day. Permission three. I'm seeing good things from you, kid. Get your iron, also I'll be needing those glasses. Alrighty, that is going to be the end of this video, um, I, I usually would just finish the area, but I am way too tired for that today, so, um, that, I'll see you guys in the next one, and I hope you enjoyed.